10-year-old boy dies in his sleep, then dad turns the empty grave plot into concrete masterpiece. Matthew Stanford Robinson This grave has become a symbol of hope after 10-year-old Matthew Stanford Robinson died in his sleep, and his father resurrected this statue. 2. Rising from Wheelchair The statue is of a boy rising from his wheelchair at the Salt Lake City Cemetery. One day while driving around doing research at the Salt Lake City Cemetery, I spotted this beautiful headstone and memorial. It immediately brought tears to my eyes, and continues to every time I visit it. Never before had I come across such a touching statue that tells so much just at first glance. This quickly became my favorite place to drive past in the cemetery, and I added it to the list of graves to visit on my Salt Lake City Cemetery tour. It speaks volumes about how in this life we may have to suffer through hardships and trials, but when we pass to the other side, our spirits are free from those earthly disabilities. Disabilities It symbolizes little Matthew being free of his wheelchair in the afterlife. Parents Dr. Ernest Robinson and his wife Annika started Ability Found after their little boy Matthew was born with severe brain damage. Unable to walk since Matthew was unable to walk, he used equipment found by Ability Found, who risked to wars wheelchairs and other equipment. Paying it forward The Robinsons are paying it forward to families who cannot afford new equipment or the high insurance co-pays. Ability Found The foundation continues to help others who suffer from spinal cord injuries, multiple sclerosis, cerebral palsy, stroke, spina bifida, cancer and other conditions. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more videos. and the old boy dies in his sleep, then dad turns the empty grave plot into concrete masterpiece. Matthew Stanford Robinson This grave has become a symbol of hope after 10-year-old Matthew Stanford Robinson died in his sleep, and his father resurrected this statue. 2. Rising from Wheelchair